we're here in Jacksonville, Florida at the Thrasher Horn Center, and I'm currently with Robert Topolis. He is the liaison between this venue and the Iglesia Cristo Church of Christ. Hello, Robert. How are you? I'm doing great, Colleen. Thank you. Wonderful. So I just wanted to ask you a little bit about the venue. Is there a reason that you chose this venue, and could you tell us a little bit about it? Sure. The, um, the, actually, there was a committee that was involved in selecting the venue. Uh, we're here at the Thrasher Horn Performing Arts Center in Jacksonville, Florida. And, and really, when we were looking for a venue, one of the things that we wanted to find was, of course, one that could have the capacity that we were expecting, which was about 1,500 to 1,700 participants. Um, and then also, parking was a consideration. The location of the venue was also important because uh, we have uh, those that are attending this event today coming from all over the southeastern seaboard of the United States. So we have to take into consideration people from coming as far north as the Carolinas, as far south as Miami. We have people coming in from Mississippi. So Jacksonville just is a natural fit. And the Performing Arts Center here is gorgeous. If you've not had a chance to go around and see it yet, it has balcony seating. Um, and it's just a really, really classy layout for this type of an event. Wonderful. And what are we doing here today? So why have this event at all? Well, today is actually the celebration of the 50 years in the West for the Iglesia de Cristo or the Church of Christ. And uh, this is a celebration that's actually happening simultaneously across the United States. It also is a simultaneous celebration of the 104th anniversary of the Church throughout the world. So you could call it a, a double celebration, if you will. And it's uh, really both, it's, it comprises of both a special service that's being held, which is being uh, broadcast globally. Um, but at the same time, we're also going to have a musical afterwards with uh, showcasing a lot of the talent, both from uh, the youth and the, uh, the more mature members of the church here in our district. And that happens right afterwards. So you mentioned globally. Uh, I assume that literally means global. So what are some of the countries? Um, this event is actually happening, uh, the, the live event is happening in Hawaii, and that's where the live event is happening there, but it's also being streamed across the globe. So here in the United States, we have venues that are here uh, in Florida, we have venues that are in the northeastern part of the United States, the central part of the United States, and if you could imagine the choreography required to be able to organize this across multiple time zones uh, to make sure that everyone is able to participate in it. Um, it was really, really a lot of planning, years worth of planning into this activity. Well, that sounds like quite the endeavor, and you guys were very dedicated in doing so. I thank you very much for your time. No, I thank you. Uh, back to you in the studio.